here in Austin, our, our business unit here has just a really good success with high-rise structures, cast-in-place structures. We win quite a few of, of the projects here in town and built some nice projects. We did Block 25, um, which is the sale building, pretty iconic building here in Austin. Yeah, cuatro, you got it. My name is David Rayner. I work with DPR Construction. I'm the concrete superintendent here on a 74-story mixed-use tower. Uh, this project in particular is just uh, so cool to be a part of because it's the tallest in Texas, and it's just a massive structure. This whole area has these giant sculptural columns yeah. that are all like unique. We've got like, they're calling them teapot columns where it, it's like a V-shape. This will all be landscaped down to the creek. We're gonna have glass on this whole face and like a nice amenity cafe area. So this whole area is gonna be beautiful when it all comes together. It also ties in for us being a self-performing general contractor and that we're out there doing the work. And if you got on the site and you haven't been on a site in a while, it's, it's gonna be intense. I mean, we're moving quick, we're moving fast. There's always material moving to the next place. It's all been choreographed and planned. So our goal is to, to model what we build and build what we model. Most 2D detailing programs will pick a range, start and finish, and just fill in the bars. Using Tecla and Trimble, we have the ability to put the bars in the model the same way that we were going to on site. So there's less waste, less duplicated bars. So we push that data to Trimble Connect and our on-site teams, project team superintendents, project engineers, project managers can use that data and consume it in Trimble Connect. As we work throughout the project and go from, you know, pursuit to pre-construction construction, that model is evolving and we're actually replacing the design models that we've received with, you know, data heavy and more accurate and more information in our Tecla models that are created by our, by our self-performed team. So we're taking that information, which interconnects really well actually with other platforms and other software for quantity takeoff and plugging in that information and extracting more accurate and more advanced information to base our planning off of that, base our pri pricing off of it. Like we have subject matter experts that are in construction engineering for concrete, for formwork, that have you know decades of experience building these towers. With a tool that can meet them at that level and their level of understanding, it makes it that much easier to explain what we want to build. I was saying earlier, this is not a box, it's not a rectangle. There's a lot of stuff that overlap each other and, and move. Being able to see how floor to floor changes and, and we're able to see some of that stuff that we're having to work around and stuff. I'm constantly doing takeoffs of stuff, so like takeoffs of columns and stairs. I can click on the pieces of the model, it tells me how many yards are in there. Clicking on multiple pieces, I can add them all up and very simply get takeoffs. But really what, it, what Triple Connect does for us is it allows us to see the project come together from the various disciplines of drawings that we have that may not marry up and we get to see the problems a lot sooner. Fly through the model and see how the changes are happening in the version history. Especially if you're using VDC in a silo, that trust isn't built until the reality happens in the field. By grabbing everybody and bringing them into the Trimble ecosystem, letting them see the concrete model early, making decisions on this is the easiest to build solution we can come up with, everybody's bought into the plan.